This year we've celebrated the great high flyers of our game, from Davies to Dietrich, Burton to Blight. Today we go out with someone who's remembered as much for his shorts and his hair as he is for his remarkable grabs, Warwick Kappa. With the help of Flight Centre, let's check out his 1987 Mark of the Year. Kappa at the back, got the simple mark, what a grab! Kappa climbs and marks spectacularly! Right, we're 95 points down. I just kicked me fifth goal, so I was still excited. Went up early, it was Warwick Kappa, it was like time stood still. And I was just sitting there for about three seconds, or probably an hour and a half. Fell asleep, woke up, just about to take it, I got a phone call. Ran off the bench, it was air traffic control. They said 747 approaching, can you get the airspace work? I said, let me take Mark of the Decade first. Oh, what a mark! Oh, he sort of hung over the back and the ball fell into his hand. That was poetry in motion. Keep the goal straight through. Only 91 points down after that. Kappa's got the sit here, and look at him go, what a mark! One over um, Laurie Serafini, kick six on him, had a bad day. One over Frawley, kick four in the first quarter, he wasn't happy. Give him a little bit of a kick in the head and boom, boom. Love Mick Martin and Danny Hughes. They both had bad heads. They had good heads for radio, so I made them worse. Give him a little knee, knee in the head. Oh, look at that! A Kappa! I did take seven a week for 11 years, let's be serious. I won that many cars, that many marks of the year. Had my own car yard. Kappa at the back of the pack. Fly, do it! Cappuccinos! You built it! Bang, straight up the ground. That's the way to go. Kappa! So it was, yeah, no, it was a good, good time for me, and um, it's good to. Um, People could refer back to it, and at least I left my name in the game, I think, a little bit. 